What's going on everyone, Daniel Rodriguez here and welcome to my 50 Shades Darker quick review. Now this is not my full movie review, there are no spoilers in my full movie review nor are there any spoilers in here. It's just quick and simple, tell you my first impressions on it and in my full movie review I do pros, cons and a final score. Uh, but with this man, 50 Shades Darker, I have to say that I really enjoyed this film better than the, the the bigger oh better than the first 50 shades of gray uh now dakota johnson is back jamie dornan is back anastasia Steele, christian gray are back man and, and i really 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 enjoyed this film a lot more because it, it doesn't 50 shades of gray it was like i'm christian gray i'm anastasia no it's just like it's there the chemistry's there there's no building up it's there. You know what I mean? Like, the first Fifty Shades of Grey, I could still go back and watch it, but it it's just the, okay, meeting each other, we know where this is going, yeah, yeah, yeah. With this, they're already established, and they're there, and I like that. Now, if you're going to go into this film, and if you have a high expectation, like Oscar award-winning acting and stuff, you're not going to like this film. If you like Fifty Shades Darker, the book, it is not 100% accurate to the book at all. They change a lot of things about it. So if you go in and, and you like the story and the chemistry, and there are people, it's not always, you know, there are certain reasons why people like these films. And, you know, main BDSM, yeah, I'm a fan of BDSM, I am. And I've said that with Fifty Shades of Grey last year, that I, I've been, it's weird, because... Fifty Shades of Grey is based on Twilight, right? Or the girl that wrote her based on Twilight, like she based it off Twilight because she was inspired by it. Twilight came out in 2007, the book, if I'm not mistaken. I just looked it up earlier and I hope that was in the movie, that was the book. I was watching, or a fan of BDSM before 2007, which is so freaking weird. So it's like, I, before Twilight was even established... You know, here it is, and then it's all popular way years later, which is, hey, not a bad thing. It makes the cells go up and everything, so why not? And it is, you know, I really enjoy the chemistry between Jamie Dornan and Anast um, Dakota Johnson. If you go in with high expectations and you're you're going to be, you know, don't, don't go with low expectations. Like, you know, oh, my... my, my what you my you know my girlfriend dragged me out to the theater it's not though it's not the human centipede don't 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 make it difficult man oh what you know you get to see Dakota Johnson a little naked and she gets to see Jamie Dornan naked oh it's like watching porn no i've seen worse f uh, films with more violent sex and shit so trust me it felt like 50 shades of gray had more sex scenes i may be wrong I'm probably wrong, but I felt like Fifty Shades of Grey had more sex scenes. I don't know. Anyway, at the bottom line, I enjoyed Fifty Shades Darker better than Fifty Shades of Grey because they're established. I still enjoy the cinematography in there. I thought the first one had better cinematography, though, but the cinematography in here was still enjoyable. Um, that's it. That's, I really recommend this film for those who are Fifty Shades of Grey fans. As in just the series of Fifty Shades of Grey. And those who like Dakota Johnson or Jamie Dornan and their chemistry from the first one. You want to see a romance film? There is. And the thing is, Christian Grey is not very, like, uh, in this film. He, he he is more of a character. Uh, not fully, but he they're all okay actors. That's all I'll say. They're all okay actors. And they finally get to flesh out their character more. And you finally understand more anyway i'll see you guys later for my full movie review plus i'm doing giveaways later in the week movie reviews tv show reviews trailer reactions unboxings much much more man stay tuned to the channel i love you all 50 shades darker if you enjoy the first one or you're a fan of the series or you like romance or you like seeing women naked you like seeing men naked this is the one for you and, and it, it's always like 50 shades darker <laughs> weird I've seen weirder movies. I, I, it's oh sex, 
Oh, whips and chains? That's what you find weird? There are weirder things out there, trust me. Very... The fucking movie called A Human Centipede. And this shit's weird to you? Whips and chains and ball gags? That's weird to you? Did you not see Pulp Fiction? I didn't see no one complaining about that shit. Anyway. I'll see you guys later. Uh, and thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, share, and hit that subscribe button. If you feel so, make sure to check out the rest of the channel. See you guys later.